Well, hi everybody. It's Tammy from Winky World Adventures here. And today just got away from me. I'm finally making this video. We are obviously leaving for Florida tomorrow morning. So trying to get all those little last minute things done. Ron had his last day of work. And so uh, he's still trying to let it sink in um, and realize that, hey, I don't have to go back anymore. So that's, I think, going to be a little, little adjustment for him. They gave him some cards today and what have you. So that was kind of nice. And he got a gift card to Starbucks. And they gave him a sweatshirt um, for the U of M Gophers. So Golden Gophers. So that was kind of nice. So we got that. And then we just got back from Aldi. Do you ever go shopping for groceries at Aldi? It's so cheap. There were a few things I wanted to pick up for the road. We don't, didn't have a lot of fresh fruit, so just needed some of that kind of stuff. So we went shopping and just got back. I picked up some banana nut muffins so we can have one morning. Bananas, you know, some bananas and apples. The honey crisp, crisp apples were on sale, so I picked some of those up and just some chips and Kleenex and things like that that we needed to get before we head out. And I saw some corn on the cob too. So I thought, hey, that would be good. So we picked some of that up because um, we're having burgers on the grill tonight. So Ron's out starting the little grill there and he's taking Snuggles out for a real quick walk. They must be hitting the trail back there already. <laughs> so... But anyway, I was just going to show you a little bit of the camper here. Um, you probably saw in our previous videos kind of what how we decorated it and everything. But just for the trip down to Florida, we had to be kind of creative and do a little bit more organizing. Because as you can see, our snack bins up there are stuffed to the, stuffed to the top. And we needed a lot more food, obviously, for this trip because we'll be cooking most of the way there. We're, you know, this is going to be a budget trip. We're not going to be eating out a whole lot unless we see something, you know, specific to an area that we really want to try. Otherwise, we're going to be trying to save money and, and cook our own food and what have you. So, um, but I had to get really super organized, like with our... Um, paperwork and stuff there. I've got a little bin on the seat next to me so I can keep track of everything and work on videos on the road. So got that all ready to go. But the big thing is back here. I don't even know if you can see it now. I'm going to turn this light on here. Um, but these bunk beds, and I wish I could get up there and turn the light on for you, but with my wrist, I can't. <laughs> Um, are pretty full. We do have a spot there for Snuggles to look out the window and a spot up here for a little lady. Just got her a little bed up there. <laughs> but otherwise, we've got lots of food for some of our office supplies so we can, um, you know, keep, keep everything organized. Our medications, vitamins there. Clothes was a little bit tricky. We've got several bins around um, with clothes because we couldn't fit everything in the bedroom closet, but it'll work, it'll work okay. Um, but then in the bathroom, we, in the shower, and we may have to move this when we shower, but it works okay. We've got kind of, here's the light switch. <laughs> the dirty clothes, and I'm hoping not to have to do too much laundry till we get down there. Um, and then we've got cat food. And then the blue, the bin on the bottom, that blue bin, is full of food for cooking, pretty much. So, um, so that's how we're staying organized right now. Uh, it's working. This is one of the better things that we used. Um, we put one of those shoe organizers on the back of the bathroom door so we can put all the washcloths went in there and then just little toiletry items that we can now stay organized and of course we had that from 
Ikea, which is really nice. And then under the sink, I got this adjustable shelf so that we can, um, I kind of organized all the cleaning supplies, alcohol, peroxide, that kind of stuff, and our little go-to bags for when we want to take a shower in the campground so we can just grab and go. And our drop-ins for the camper toilet and stuff are in there. So everything's pretty organized, I have to say. We know where things are, and I think that's the key. Because if I didn't know where things were, it would be really hard to to cook and what have you. So, but our freezer is stuffed. You know, we haven't got a huge freezer, but it's pretty full. Um, and the fridge. So I'm sure by the time we get to Florida, you know, it'll look a lot different, but yeah, we're excited. We're very excited. We're going to try to get to bed really early tonight and get up early and get on the road early. We want to get to the campground. We're going to uh, near Madison, Wisconsin is where we're camping the first night. And uh, I think we're going to stay there for two nights. So this is going to be kind of a slow trip down and, and we'll kind of tell you about where we're going and where we're staying along the way. But it'll be fun to kind of get to explore a little bit and see the fall colors as well along the way. So we're very excited and pumped to go tomorrow morning. So yeah, I don't know. Again, we have to weigh the trailer in the morning to make sure we're okay on weight and everything. So that's goal one. And I think we're going to stop at Starbucks and have a little breakfast on our way out. Kind of a treat on our first morning because we have that gift card now. <laughs> so we thought, hey, why not? But so that's the plan. We are set to go. We're ready to go. We've got everything we need. Our lists are checked off. And uh, now it's just a matter of getting up and going. So we'll be leaving the campground early. It rained again here all day. It's The ground is just saturated right now. Um, just poured and thundered lightning this morning. So I pretty much just took the day to work on videos and things, um, which was kind of nice to catch up a little bit. But yeah, Ron's done working. So we're going to celebrate with some corn on the cob and burgers here in a bit. So anyway, I hope you're having a good evening, whatever you're doing. And I will be in touch tomorrow. I'm sure I'll make a little video showing just us on our way as we take off. Take care and God bless.